Looking for a hassle-free way to scrape TikTok? Let me introduce you to our tool, Social Media Scraping API. I'm Jakubas, a technical researcher at Smart Proxy. And in this video, I'll show you how to extract TikTok profiles, videos, video descriptions, hashtags, and sounds. So let's get started. We'll start by going to smartproxy.com. There you will find Social Media Scraping API under the Scraping API section. Here, you may click on start your free trial. After you have created your account, you may navigate to social media, authentication method, and set your password. After setting your password, we may head to API Playground to send an example request. Here you can choose between TikTok profile and TikTok post. We'll choose TikTok profile in this case. We'll use NBA for this example. Here you can also choose your language and your geolocation. Let's go ahead and send the request. We got our response. Here you will find the data and you can download it in JSON or copy it. You can also copy the request in curl to test it locally. To do that, press on copy and enter your username and password. Additionally, you can find many helpful resources in our GitHub. We have a social media scraping API repository, and here you will find code examples in Node.js, PHP, and Python. There is also the list of available targets, parameters, and a link to our Postman collection. Let's run that. You can form the collection and test the social media scraping API locally. To test it locally in Postman, you'll need to enter your credentials. You can get those in your dashboard. Once you have entered your credentials, you may test this request locally. Here, you can scrape TikTok profile, TikTok posts, and there are also two ways to get your data in real time and callback based. To get your callback based data, you'll need to create a task. Here, we are scraping TikTok posts and once you've created the task, you'll get a task ID as a response. Once you have the task ID, you may choose to get your data in a parse JSON or raw HTML. Let's get the raw HTML data first. Here, you'll need to paste your task ID and click send. You can also see that the state is suspending because it might take a few minutes for the data to be processed. Once that is done, you'll get your raw HTML. And here's how you get your parts JSON. And that's a wrap on TikTok scraping. It was easy, right? Now don't forget to try our social media scraping API for free. The link is below in the video description. Sign up and see if this tool is your jam.